Hi guys and welcome back to Rachel's Enchanting Cake. Now for today's tutorial I'm just going to be showing you how to do these super cute yet super easy cupcake toppers. I'm using the Outboss by Sweet Stamp by Amy Cakes. They're really really easy to use and I can't wait to show you how easy they are. And also a new embossing set by Sweet Stamp. So let's make a start. Everything to the point that you need to know. So these come in loads of different words, sayings and phrases. This one is the Spellbound Outboss set. Just remember, Sweet Stamp do post and ship worldwide. And I will leave a link to her website below this tutorial. Just in more detail, this is what you're going to be working with. So they're nice and solid and it's like engraved into the actual plastic. This is so you end up with the fondant coming out rather than being emboss. Start by rolling out a small amount of high quality fondant. Here I am using Renshaw's Extra. I roll this in between 5mm spacers. Place your outboss directly on top of the fondant and using a rolling pin I then simply roll it down on both sides. Then you gently want to peel away the outboss stamp and it really is as easy and as simple as that. Finally, using a round circle cutter the size of a cupcake topper, I simply cut away the excess fondant. I then simply repeat this process both with the happy birthday outboss cut around it, roll it on both sides and there's one cupcake chopper and I love this one coming up next. It matters not what someone is born but what they grow to be. I absolutely love those words and again just repeat that. Remember there's loads of different options, there's loads of different ones available. I'm just showing you a few here and just how easy they are to actually use and so so effective. Now, because I'm painting directly onto black fondant, I'm actually going to paint with chocolate. I'm using these amazing drips by Dinky Doodle. You just melt them in the microwave. I've got red and yellow because obviously the paint's going to be an awful lot thicker then and go on an awful lot easier. I'm just going to place them into my um, paint palette once I've melted them. And if I need to re-melt them along the way, just pop them back into the microwave. I would also advise investing in some of these brushes by Sweet Stamp as they are very, very, very small and perfect for painting with. Simply take your time with your individual colours, just going over the letters on each outbossed cupcake topper. Do not wash the brush in between coats because obviously water affects chocolate, but your brush will wash beautifully. So don't worry about it damaging the brush. I then simply add a few sprinkles and these ones are finished and left to one side in order to dry. So for the remaining cupcakes, I use the Sweet Stamp Elements Spellbound range. So you get all these little parts and you choose which ones you want on each cupcake. Now you don't need one of these cupcake stamps, but if you do have one, it will make it an awful lot more easy. And this is what you can achieve and the possibilities are absolutely endless. So before I paint these, I decide to give them a little background. So using the same sized cupcake topper, but the opposite scalloped edged side, I simply cut out three circles to place my patterns directly on there. I simply stick these down with a small amount of edible glue and then you want to paint them using one of the very fine brushes. This time I just use um, edible food paint, black, because we're going directly onto the yellow. Now I used the very fine brush that comes with the Sweet Stamp set when you order the brush set to actually paint mine because these are very, very, very small and intricate. Remember they can also be used on the sides of your cake the possibilities with these are totally endless, just let your imagination run wild. And if you now asked for any Harry Potter creations, this is just such a time saver. 
Happy baking, guys. I'm going to be back soon with more detailed, larger content. I have a lot of ideas going around my head. For now, I just wanted to show you how amazing these products are and easy to use.